He had a big game the other night or last night and uh, needs some offense from him. However, part of his job is going to be to stop that guy right opposite number 87, Sidney Cosby. No easy task, Brendan, that's for sure. Matt Martin from center. Loves it downplayed by Latang. Given up. Martin throws it on net, and there's the first shot of the game as it's covered up. It's moved by Pollock to get a little open. Oh, back door, and Barzell couldn't get it on net. Yeah, he fanned on a little bit. A wide open net for him. Pollock again, tipped on goal to Smith the save. Tough stop there off the glove hand. Sit off into the corner, and then Barzell over to Ryan Pollock, who slides it to Anders Lee. Doubt that way. 20 games in, it's been an 80 20 split. 16 starts for Varlamov, just four as Bovillia cuts in, and it's fought off by DeSmith. Might have had a chance to score, but Barzell was in good position. That pass onto the tape of Nelson with a step on Gensel. Nelson's backhand to Smith. Has it in his pads as he was twisting. He can cut that off. Barzell will try and start the engines. Good read by Green. Veteran while he move. A little give and go with Anders Lee. Barzell got to the forehand. Rebound was there off of Everly. Can't fish it back in front. Matt Barzell with a good opportunity. Pass out to the wing over to Anders Lee and then get back. Be a slight carryover if they don't score as Wallstrom drops it off. Letty for Bailey and some open ice. Bailey takes a second, gives it back for Letty. Wallstrom down low, shoot, scores! Oliver Wallstrom with the quick release on the power play. What a bullet. I'm not sure what the number, what power play is going to be if successful, whether it's the one or the two. There is no such thing. Good puck movement and Wallstrom, a wicked shot, a one-timer right on the dot area. Letty lays a perfect pass right where Wallstrom wants it, and that one's up and over. Great shot and a great release he has. We hadn't really seen it have an effect on the game. He's missed the net quite a few times, but that was the first time we saw it. And you can go, yeah, that was something special. That's different than it, comes, than it comes off a lot of other guys' sticks. It's his first start against the Penguins. Face off, win off the crossbar, courtesy of Jared McCann, and it jumps over the glass. Boy, one thing about McCann, he can really shoot the puck, too, very, very well. A hurry and good face off win by Malkin, and that's a bit of a screenshot, because you need time to be able to get out there and block a shot. Allen's won 60% of the draws in that. Turned into a good opportunity for Leo Komarov. Using his speed, yes, I said his speed. He beats Math or Marino to the puck. And uh, Uncle Leo gets a pretty good opportunity, but the puck's rolling. He tries to go five hole. And nice pass by Matt Martin. He just flipped, again, just flipped it into the hole. That long range shot from Thompson swallowed up by DeSmith. Well, at least take away the low part of the net, and they all butterfly. Here's Matt Barzell kicking it to his stick. Dropped it off for Anders Lee. Lee with a shot. Big rebound. Pellick, and it's stopped by to Smith. And now Bailey approaching the halfway point of the power play. Letty for Bailey. Takes a step. Nothing there. Back over for Letty. Wallstrom doesn't shoot. Cross ice pass connects with Bailey. Bailey, Pajot. He scores! JG Pajot muscles it between the legs of DeSmith. Another power play goal, and the Islanders lead two to nothing. Power play is they they get Marino to come all the way over. Excuse me, CC to see how far out he was. Now he can't cover the slot area in front of the net. Bailey with a great pass, and boy, you, you, I mean that's a strong bottom hand for Pajot as he gets it by to Smith. But Islanders again with a good puck movement, and then this power play unit now basically they're two for two. Latang for Rust into the zone. Left off for Malkin, stolen away by Sezikis. Casey Sezikis shorthanded, in alone, he lost it, and DeSmith able to cover it up. A little tap from Gensel on the back check, disrupted Sezikis on the breakaway. Take another look, Sezikis puts pressure on Malkin, and he just buries his head and just goes as hard as he can go, and that, that's a penalty, Brendan, that's a penalty. I can't believe, that not only was it a high stick, it was a slash, I can't believe the referee didn't call that. And Sezikis has every right to be angry on that play. That's just a terrible non-call by, by the referee. Islanders have had plenty of opportunities and really completely outplayed them. As you mentioned, should be a four or five goal lead. And I think just got to keep taking it to them, not, uh, not sitting back. Penguins got two shots on their first power play. As Sidney Crosby goes down low, Rust with a wide open look, and Sorokin made the save as he stacked the glove on top of the pad. So the game, Sidney Crosby going down low to Rust, and you can see that where Sorokin's not moving as a good position. And Nelson 
Scrambles to it in the corner. Pajot finds an open pellet. Stepping in. Goes down low. Bailey to the slot. Nelson got the shot away. And DeSmith was able to figure it out. Good shot in the slot area for, for the Islanders. Pellick taking a little look. Bailey in the slot. Perfect shot there. As, that was Walston, I believe. Josh Bailey sends it ahead. Pajot hit the post on the empty net, but it will not matter. Two weeks between them, but Ilya Sorokin posts back-to-back -back shutouts for the Islanders as they beat the Penguins 2-0.